you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, Jim. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem at Jabbar to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee in a match. Just so wise. Bruce Lee enters the octagon with his mind set on one thing tonight, that UFC champion. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. Right, so the UFC is back at the O2 Arena here in London, England. The adult beverages are flowing. And we're gonna feed off this crowd tonight as usual here in the UK, BC. You know, a lot of times you sit next to the octagon and because we wear these headphones, you can barely hear. But when we come to London, headphones or not, you are gonna know that these people are loud, they're raucous, and they're ready to put on a show. They're ready to also cheer hard for the English fighters. Lands a kick there with the lead leg. Nice work by Lee. Nice shot there by the champ. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Push kick there to the body. All right, so the taller fighter lands a knee, and Daniel Cormier to my right, I can hear him saying, I wish I was a little bit taller. Oh, huge Superman punch. Back to the left hand now, unable to connect. Oh, and so now he lands another combination, so it's never just one shot. There's always two or three coming behind. A lot of times people throw singular strikes. Not this gentleman. This man is stringing four, five, six in a row. What a great job. A oh, little single collar tie there. Blocks the shot there, lands that straight counter. Back to the jab now. Oh, good block there. That uppercut appeared to find its home. Just over three minutes to go. Another nice kick there, solid series of kicks. They're all landing now. These boys are standing right in front of each other, just kind of going at it. Oh, heavy kick downstairs. He's got the single collar tie. Oh, and he lands yet another flush knee. That's gonna leave a mark. And again, when you're using this length as effectively as he is here tonight, we might get a finish here in the not too distant future. Throws that tee, and it lands. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes on. That's good defense to block that punch. Oh, collar tie. Look at the skip action that allows you to land that big knee. Well, champ, I don't see that well, but it's hard to miss the redness underneath that elbow. A lot of bodily investment from his opponent tonight. Yeah, it's an investment, John. It may not pay dividends right now, but the more you go there, the more damage you do eventually, it will show itself. Right now, it's starting to show. Certainly showing off some good hands here tonight. Oh, how about the accuracy to land right there? His opponent's wobble, champ. He's hurt bad. He cannot take another shot like that. Oh, big knee to the body. Oh! Shot to the body, turned back by Lee. Oh, nice knee. Yeah. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Oh, 
All right, so now we start to see some redness underneath the elbow. You got to think he's going to continue to attack the body with all of his strikes. Well, his opponent has not done anything to deter him. He should keep doing this, keep going to the well until his opponent finds an answer. Because right now, he seems lost to it. Big knee lands right from the opponent's midsection. Lee gets hit with a kick. Oh, nice. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Nice punch lands over the top. Under 20 seconds now to go. Oh, nice jab up top by Lee. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. 10 seconds to go in round one. Ooh, looking uh, to go to the leg kick uh, here, just out of range. Horn sounds for the end of round one. All right, you're doing great, okay? Want more of the same. You are controlling the entire fight. Stay sharp, don't get relaxed. So wherever we're at, you're still... All right, now we take a look back at some of the action in that previous round, DC. A lot to like on both sides, Will. I mean, both were intent on going forward. And what happens when nobody wants to take a step back? They meet in the middle. That's exactly what they did and they both found success over the course of that round. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, second round underway. All right, here we go with our next round, DC. Pretty good game plan in the previous round. Attacked the body to great effect, and we'll look to continue to do so here. He has done a great job of making the investment. The investment to the body that may not pay dividends early, but as the fight goes long, you will see it start to pay itself off. Well, new round, same narrative. He continues to punish the body yet again, just as he did in the previous frame. Beautiful shot lands to the leg. Another one. When both are prepared, these are the types of fights that we expect. Effective with the jab. This pace is just absurd, and he has kept it up throughout the fight. Shades of Max Holloway against Calvin Cater, punches in bunches. I mean, being there, watching Max Holloway do what he did was super impressive. So to even list his performance alongside that tells you how this guy is fighting tonight. That one certainly found the target. Let's work, guys. Nicely timed kick to the body for the champion. Beautiful technique on the straight right hand. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, solid kicks are landing. He has most certainly found the range on the feet. Three minutes and change to go in round two. All right, let's go. Let's oh, he lands another strike to the body here and just continues to punish his opponent's body here in this round, just like he did in the previous one. Oh, that strike to the body, man. You know, the kicks do hurt, right? These big body kicks, these high kicks, even though they're getting blocked, they do hurt. Great upper body movement defensively, slips another strike there, and offensively, he hasn't been a world beater, but defensively, he's been strong tonight. And that has to cause frustration for the opponent, not being able to hit a guy that you want to really put away. But that's a testament to the head and the activity and the awareness of this fighter defensively. Well, that strike landed cleanly. He does a great job getting out of that clutch position. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Oh, doing work with the jab. Two minutes to go round two. Nice box. Stay aggressive. Both guys appeared to land there. 
Well, lands a good series of kicks there, DC. It really didn't take him long to get a good beat on his opponent. He figured the timing, and now he's been driving kick after kick into his opponent. All right, so now his body language really starting to change, and the bruises starting to accumulate on that side. I mean, you're looking at it, right? When you can visibly see the damage on the body, you know that the work has been done. What a beautiful game plan put together by this team. Oh, and he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Oh, body kick attempt here. It's no good. He lands a takeout. Yep, got to be very careful there. Constantly a moving target. Ooh. Less than a minute to go in the round. Man, his sidekick is just killer. You saw it right there. He has a really good sidekick. He's so fast at doing that technique, and there is no tell when he attempts that certain strike. Lance, a good series of kicks here. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Quick jab. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Lee's now switching his stance. Well, he's the taller fighter and able to land a knee to the body with relative ease there. Just turning his hip over into the leg kick. Final seconds here of round two. Back to the leg kick now. That one's no good. Stop. All right, take a seat, bud. Breathe, slow it down. How you feel? Great, man, that was awesome. I told you you were gonna win this fight with cardio. He is already spent. All right, we now take a look back at some of the highlights from that last round, DC. A lot for the replay guys to choose from. I mean, these guys are going to be very busy trying to find what replay to show you guys. Lands on both sides of the octagon, both guys fought great. What a phenomenal round. You ready? You ready? Do Here it. we go, third round of this championship fight. All right, next round is underway. You know these are two of the more conditioned fighters on the roster, so cardio is not going to be an issue here. And for some fighters, you know, you can have one of those adrenaline dumps or the cardio abandons you on fight night. Not the case for these two guys. Both look very fresh as we start this next round. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. More than one, more than one. Punches and bunches. Big kick lands. Well, he might be working. Oh! He's hurt so bad. He's got to find safety. Find a way that you can recover. Oh, and that kick is blocked. Big shot lands for both guys. Oh, well timed with that team. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. Oh, big left hook there. Back out, back out. He needs to get some space now. Well, he misses with the left punch there. High cross, baby, high cross. High cross. Nice jab by Lee. Obvious redness on the right side of his body. Just over three minutes now to go. Oh, nice jab to the head by Lee. All right, so a good series of kicks by him there. He has mixed it up beautifully, I think, on the feet tonight. He is kicking everywhere tonight. He's doing a fantastic job. Trying to kick the leg out. Oh, that is a furious inside leg kick. You ever taken like a five finger to the inside of your leg? That don't feel good. Never mind a kick like that. A full, I mean, slapping your leg hurts. 
Imagine someone this size kicking you with his shin in the inside of your leg. You cannot take many of those kicks. Well, you got to think he's happy with this performance here tonight. Essentially, just the way he drew it up, it's been a striking clip. It's like a fairy tale. He's doing everything he wanted to do, and his opponent isn't doing much to try and deter him and really mess with the game plan. Unable to land with that punch. And now Leather being thrown on both sides. Oh, that body shot hurt him. Well, he has stayed busy and he has stayed accurate. Nice combination. Very accurate, a lot of activity in the hands. Look phenomenal tonight. Nice kick, yep. All right, so there it is, yet another strike to the body. Feels like that was what the game plan was rooted in coming in here tonight. Absolutely, John, and you could think that he's setting him up to go up top, or honestly, if he continues to land at this rate, at this target, he could finish him here. So I wouldn't change anything unless he makes you. Oh, nice. Well, no feeling out process tonight. Both fighters invoking damage on the other DC. Yes, we knew this would be very competitive. We knew that this was a tough fight. We knew that both guys would be very evenly matched in this fight. But we didn't expect to see this type of war between these two guys. Oh, nasty cut there, right on the bridge of the nose. All right, less than a minute here to go now in round three. Beautiful jab lands. Don't stop, don't stop. Real sneaky body kick. Take down a template in the round and he gets it. Big right hook there by the champ. All right, so not enough action there on the ground. The referee brings the fight back to the feet, and we are back underway. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. Nice straight punch there. Potentially two more to go. We are headed to the championship rounds. All right, so the round is over, and you see some obvious bleeding now. Looks like the cut is on the nose. Yes, it is. Cut man will try to get in there and shut it, but of course, as soon as he absorbs a strike this next round, that thing could reopen. Certainly bears watching here moving forward. All right, back to the stools for 60 seconds. That gives us a chance to re-rack some replays, including what we believe is the strike that caused the cut on his nose. Yeah, beautiful strike that lands, causes this cut, opens him up on the bridge of the nose. It's not a bad cut, but if he continues to go forward, his opponent is Where's a right? sniper, and he's gonna right. keep hitting him in that same yeah. spot. Move your head. Really choose the times in which you're going to advance to try to get to this guy. You gotta be careful, though because he is so good at picking his shots. And of course, it's hard to know the extent to which that has compromised his breathing, but that corner was fired up. They want him to be more dis defensively sound as this fight continues. Let's go, keep moving forward now. Going to the knee strike now. All right, seems as though his sole focus is attacking that cut, and man, it's getting bad now. A lot of blood flowing. Yeah, as it should be. But he should be focused on getting to that cut, making his opponent pay. He did the work. He opened up the cut. Now it's on him to continue on the path and make the ringside position come in here and try to stop this fight. Kick to the body now. That one won't land. Oh, side kick. Well done. Oh, he's got the single collar locked in the clinch now. Nice crack there. What a great job getting that kick to the target. Straight punch is good. Lands that beautiful jab. 
Another powerful kick there. A lot of volume with the feet tonight for him. It's unbelievable to watch somebody make kicking the base of their fighting style. He has shown us that it's possible. Let's go. Let those hands go. Lee gets caught with that punch. Oh, you gotta love the leg kicks, and there it is. His cardio is great right now. He still seems fresh. He can, seems like he can fight two more rounds if he needs to. Man, his body not looking too good right now. It's not quite Dominic Reyes against Jan Blachowicz, but these body strikes are really starting to add up. They're starting to pay dividends. You know, he spoke to us about this earlier in the week, how he was going to eat this guy up from bottom to top. He was gonna go in reverse. That is exactly what he has done. Well, it didn't take him long to get a good read on his opponent. Another good series of kicks there. He thought the kicks would be the key tonight, and they sure have been. That one was clean. Great punch. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attack. He threw a lot of punches, but he couldn't get the one to land on the button that would end the night. Oh, he kicked him in the head. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Just missed with the leg kick. It's a pretty good jab. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Take it for a ride. Nice double leg. Nice finish. All right, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you got to be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. Oh. And he's back up. One minute now to go in round four of a possible five. Nice technique on the sidekick. Well, he is clearly faded in this one, and I'm not talking about the high and tight skin fade on my man Daniel oh. Cormier. He got stunned earlier in the round, and, and mentally I feel like he checked out a little bit. He hasn't been able to build back and fight the way that we're used to seeing him fight. He needs to take a breath, take a moment, and get back to work. Lee going for the leg kick. Nothing doing there. Oh, that's a nice strike. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. Two, two, Inside leg kick lands. That leg's gonna be beat up. It's already getting beat up bad. Oh, Horn sounds for the end of round stop, four. Stop, stop. All right, let us re-rack some replays of the damage done in that round, see if we can isolate the strike that caused the cut. Yeah, a nasty cut opens up when he lands there. It's a beautiful shot that gets to the target. He has not been responsible defensively, and he's really paying for it, because now he's dealing with that nasty cut. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. Fifth and final round. All right, this should be good as our next round gets underway. We nearly had a knockout in the previous round, but the corner seems to think they have their fighter back in the game. It felt fun watching such an exciting moment, but it is a testament to this fighter in the toughness and the durability that he possesses, that he's still here right now with an opportunity still to win the fight. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Hook lands. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Back and forth we go. Real quick leg kick. 
Lee's all sorts of bruised up on his body. That is gonna hurt something fierce tomorrow. He got that leg up quick. Beautiful head kick lands. Well, now these kicks are really starting to pile up since he found his range. This could be trouble. Right on the button. Ooh, another shot to the head. Guess to the single collar tie now. Oh, roundhouse kick. Style points on that one. Swing and a big miss by Lee. Ooh, Superman punch lands. Just out of range with the big right hand. What a great fight. Damage doled out on both sides. Perhaps some bonus money coming the way of these two individuals at night 10. 50K, baby. Somebody's getting paid. These two guys are doing a great job in a fight that is so competitive, that is so evenly matched. These two really will be proud of the effort that they have shown inside the octagon tonight. He's got to either go southpaw or he has to actually just try to throw the whole kitchen sink at him. Nice punch, Lynn. He gets to the single collar tie. Look for him to drive and move his opponent to find openings to land that free hand. Nice one-two there. Oh, pretty good technique as he lands the sidekick, DC. Real nice technique to land that sidekick. He did a great job of getting that leg up and then right to the target. Two minutes now to go on this one. Well, I'm not sure how much more damage he can take to the body. You may want to drop that elbow defensively. Of course, that opens you up to damage upstairs. Pick your poison for him here as he continues to absorb damage. Oh, nice. Lands the low kick. Man, he is unrecognizable as far as that midsection is concerned. Might have a fractured rib. He's going to be urinating blood for a week. <laughs> this dude's in trouble. He's in trouble. Hey, for as bad as it is right now, and this fight may get stopped because of this damage, tomorrow will be much worse. This guy does not have much fun to look forward to in the next few days. And there's a takedown attempt. Oh, that cut on his nose is only getting worse. Not good. What a fight. Oh! There's his jab. Knee to the body. They're trading huge shots here. We'll see who's the last man standing. Oh, inside kick. Oh, with authority, the body. He gets to the single collar tie. Look for him to keep that elbow tight and throw punches with his free hand. The official decision is in. It resides with Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest 50-45. For the winner, by unanimous decision, and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Mixed martial arts royalty, folks. Bruce Lee, lighten up your living room tonight and given this capacity.